Right, so after a while this is the window that is showing keyboard that you want to use and this is English Here, United States. Now we can go look for any updates. Type your email address or phone number, then follow the instructions to sign in. I'll catch up with you once that's done. Alright, I'm just going to do offline account. You're about to set up an offline account, but I wanted to make sure you know, Windows works... Type what you want to name your account. No password for me. I like Cortana. I'll just leave everything as is. So for Windows 10 you have um, the option to, if you have a, a valid key, then you can just enter it uh, or you could join the program that your computer will get the, the updates first. Uh, so if you join that program then Microsoft will let you use it or you could just um, purchase your own key in this case uh, Windows 10 home is like about a hundred bucks there's other ways to to make it work but I'm not allowed to to talk about that alright so that's it we got Windows 10 There's the two gigs that we selected. Here you can enter your product key. Let's see the drivers. Um, you should do updates and if there are missing drivers then um, you'll need to look for them I'll post a, another video 
uh, with a program that I like to use to update my drivers and search for for drivers that are not online okay. let's turn it off power shutdown so if you open the VMware workstation then you have your Windows 10 right there so that's it you can play with it turn it on there's your Windows 10 and then you can install any software you want like if you want to test a software or something then you can do so and like mentioned before you could install instead of Windows 10 Windows 7 or Windows 8 maybe Ubuntu Mate Linux any operating system that you want you can install it as a virtual machine even a Mac Mac OS you can install it like a virtual machine and there's tutorials for doing all of those takes a little bit to load but here we are right so if you like this video please like it and subscribe I'll make another video on how to download the, the drivers and how to set up Windows 10 um, in a way that is easy uh, for most people that are used to Windows 7 to use it thank you very much